When schools were forced to close, seniors had to stay home and miss out on all the big milestones like prom, spring break, and game nights. But now they're getting a chance to walk across the graduation stage and see their classmates do the same thing, but on the big screen. Traditions run deep at Clinton High School. But it's these moments seniors didn't realize would be the last times they'd get to be together. It's not fair. Finishing school virtually wasn't in Annika Lander's picture. I've gone through school for 13 years and I've, all I want is my graduation and the end of my senior year. The school district is trying to give her a glimpse of that. But to know that our school district cares this much about us means a lot. Typical graduations don't fit the rules of a socially distant world. That's why this year, one student at a time will stand on stage, each getting their own ceremony. They get to experience that, their name being called, walking across the stage, receiving the diploma, having their tassel turned. All steps, Superintendent Jay Chalk says a production company will film, then edit into a truly memorable video. And the final show will play here at the Kenda Drive-In. So every senior will get two tickets and it will be two for two cars. For Principal Tim Smith, it's about giving seniors a feel for the commencement they deserve. It's not normal. They will remember this for a lifetime. There's a way that we can still get everyone together in turn becoming an important life lesson for seniors trying to navigate an uncertain road ahead. All I can really do is acknowledge that it's not great, but it is what it is and I can't fix it. So I might as well make the best of it. The school district tells me it's fielded calls from schools across the state who are now looking to hold similar ceremonies. I'm Susan Alcori, back to you.